responsibility, acceptance and discipline comes about. Now, you discipline yourself, you discipline your mode of life in such a way that it automatically becomes a search. For these are the prerequisites on the spiritual path, a sense of responsibility, a sense of acceptance. When life becomes regulated, you will find that a lot of physiological and biological and psychological changes will take place in you. Embarking on the householder's path, you become a karma yogi. So, as responsibility, acceptance, duty, love, all that increases, then you reach a stage where you act for the sake of action. But in the householder's path, there might be difficulties, but those difficulties are to our advantage. Now, if you to recluse yourself as a spiritual seeker, you would be missing all this. Hmm? Look how much you are losing. And I tell you, in this age, we don't need these yogis or these sadhus roaming around the streets hmm? without doing any hard work and living of the fat of the land by other people's charity. We need workers. We need people to do. And that will bring about a greater sanity in this world. If you want to get mad, hmm? or go on the verge of schizophrenia or any kind of these mental aberrations, then I show you a very simple way. Just do nothing. Just do nothing. And you see how your mind and body will deteriorate. All kinds of physical and mental diseases will come about. We try and think uplifting thoughts. We read good books. We read, uh, we listen to words of wisdom. Hmm? Over which we mull. Hmm? Now there is something there. First you hear, then you mull over it, and then you practice it.